Hello. Glass here. Trials of Mana. A game where I can't afford equipment or armor at least for my allies and then I act surprised when they die. Something like that. Anyway, uh, we're in the part of the game where we do eight dungeons with no plot in the middle, because we got the plot before the dungeons, and what more do you need to know than there are eight big monsters? Uh, I wanted to do wind last because I actually have a saber spell that'll be effective, and I think I landed at Shimmering Ruins last time, but then was like, there's no save point at the start. No loot. Oh, is this gonna... Okay, it did not open a path to the save point. What did it actually do? It moved that. Did it move anything else? Well, I'm just gonna leave that one red then. XP. Weren't the previous area enemies also level 48? We might be catching up in level. were small and I attacked the small thing. I've been eaten! Okay, my allies broke me out. I think specifically Charlotte broke me out. Despite me not deserving it. I don't need that. Everybody's at max HP. It is unwise to get in our way. Seeds. Not a lot of actual items. Oop, that's not the jump button. I assume that switch will move those, but I think those are also a bridge to that treasure chest, so I want to get the treasure first. there'd be a way up around here. Oh, if I just looked better at the map. Light Gazer's Ring. I will, of course, selfishly claim that for Kevin. switch over there for some reason. Right, now we trigger this switch. Oh, you can't jump off that for some reason. This might be the question mark seed. Nope, two honey elixirs. Not that we need more question mark seeds anymore. Abilities about to wear off. Ow. 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 Ow.
took one hit, and then a Healing Light Plus was cast, so... was doing some damage there. I guess that would have been a major shortcut if you could fall down, but also you'd be stuck until you beat the boss and got warped out of the dungeon. Looks like this dead ends, according to the map. Three cups of wishes. <laughs> No. So wait, just one silver knight is the whole encounter? Hi. Right. Easy little cactus. Ah, right, that runaway timer benefit. to find that little cactus. Not sure it's worth going that way. That was hardly worth the trouble. I defeated within 20 seconds. I was wondering if I was going to defeat that within 10 seconds, and then I would have been just invincible for the whole fight. Just looking around before I flip the switch in case it blocks anything off. Alright. Oh! Another little cactus. Now we can run away fast. For if I don't feel like fighting something. Not that running away took like any prize at all, or time at all. I read the word prize at the same time I was trying to say something. But yeah, running away is already really fast. It's fast enough at least that you tend not to get hit <gasps> while attempting it. Oh. Wait, did I just not? See that treasure? Like, I came over here. <laughs> okay. There's the question mark seed, in case you were wondering. This dungeon does have one. Focusing on dodging, at the start at least. Don't really feel like dealing with three armored enemies. Unless I have to. Seems like they are kind of blocking the way I need to go. But I could super fast run away. Alright, two is less than three. The things you learn here. Time to defeat the Benevadon of Light. Oh no. Labyrinth of Ruins. 
Oh, I must have come this way before, but... You know, I'll just... I have six of these. Let's just make it nighttime again. Seems like that w might be a strong advantage against the light Benevidon. <laughs> Plus I have Kevin in the party. Oh, careful. No ordinary, no ordinary eye, eye monster. monster. How many eye monsters are you familiar with, Kevin? I will not fall. Wait, I ran away, but I was probably still invincible. Ah. Why don't you just heal everyone? trying to attack those. I don't know how much damage that was gonna do, and Charlotte can overheal people by 30% of their HP. So if I just got a heal off, we'd be pretty safe. boss put lightsaber on you, it was the whole party, and that Charlotte affecting the whole party would be really awesome. Just having saber spells and all that was handy. It cursed me. Oh, I, I have a part of the claw. Uh, putting lightsaber on myself isn't going to help very much. Anyway, that was it. I thought he was gonna lightsaber more as well. I'm used to it happening specifically to the character I'm controlling every time right before the DPS check based on my first playthrough of the game. But maybe it's not quite so targeted. I guess it was right before the DPS check, and then I like cast the wrong element, which actually made things worse. Anyway, we won. Just ate some damage. It, it was a demo of what it looks like when you fail the DPS check. 
You gotta show off these things when you're making a video series, right? That is six Benevidons defeated. Only two left! We're nearly there! Just two more Benevidons to go! Eh, Benevidon Schmenevidons. These monsters are easy! I really wanted to see how that was spelled <laughs> without the blur. <laughs> the Nevadons, Schmidnevadons. Oh, and then we have to walk to the other port. I was thinking the night market was where we got on a boat, and so I was surprised when I landed at somewhere that wasn't the night market, but I guess you just can't land there. I should check on my training points, by the way. More luck. We have a very crit-focused build, and I at least hope that luck affects critical hit rate. It's extra potent. Also gain status if increase affects yourself. Yeah, that seems good. We'll work towards that. One point short. But we're working on it. Oh, victory! <laughs> One down. Oh wait, these are level 14. <laughs> no more enemies. Not until next time. This enemy isn't even a threat. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Oh, it is unwise to get in our way. Strengthen. Time for retreat. This one is so annoying! Nah! Bye! Hey, glad we unlocked that quick escape. <laughs> Saving probably like five seconds on this journey. Don't worry, I've got this! Let the magic flow through me! See you around! I wonder if the runaway timer is already affected by your character level versus the enemy's character level. Because for some reason, so many games make it harder to run away the more you would actually need to run away for tactical purposes. It's like running away exists as a convenience mechanic. Oh, hey. Leave it to me, Wookiees! Oh. oh, hey, these are actually level 50. We must continue to triumph. Ah, free ins and a twenty percent shop discount is the next benefit. I wonder if I'll get there. I might actually be finding less than half the little cacti. So you're here. Oh, I'm doing wind right now. I thought the other location, the Laurent, the Kingdom of Wind, would be whatever. Let's just do this since we're here. Welcome. I think I have, I have all the weapons. Yeah, I have all the weapons. And they didn't Come add again. new ones. You have Mew equipment to sell. There's also a stone tablet that tells God the statue or something. God is prophecy. Pet has a strange place well, in the meantime. Quality armor. Oh, I think they were telling us about like a secret are. place where you could get like even better gear or something. Hmm. Ooh, exciting. Maybe I should have actually read the text in more detail. Without quality armor, it won't matter how good we should do you well. This is useful. Anyway, uh, not really bothering with the headgear that's only worth three total stat points. Come again. Prioritizing actually getting the main body armor for everyone. at 
at me. Remember how it works. I'm just gonna take the shortcut to the end, actually. It is unwise to get in our way. Going down. Next. So I don't know if there's like additional treasure or anything if you actually do this area. How how is hardly worth the trouble? Because I kind of just tried to level up a dungeon that already had a shortcut through the entire dungeon. Can't you tell? We are getting dangerous. We are getting dangerous. Yeah. Much like a duck with uh, dark wings. Stay true. Just weak enemies. ring. Is that going to be the wind resistance ring or is that going to be a ring I could have gotten very long ago? No, it's... They made it a shining spot instead of a treasure chest. I guess so that they could add it to an existing dungeon or something without throwing something off. So yeah, there was probably a question mark seed if I searched the whole dungeon. Done. In, in the sky. Now I really wonder why we had to walk all the way from a town to uh, this Benevadon. Not like it was actually that long a walk, though. It would be funnier, or, well, weirder, if we'd had to do, like, a whole giant dungeon of wind again. Oh, defeat the Benevidon! Help us out, Flammy! <laughs> oh, I didn't cast any buffs. Uh, to get up so I can stop that. I guess I'm just chewing through his hit points so fast he's trying to do his, like, desperation attacks all the time. Having two heads to hit is awful nice of him. So that's the fight. <laughs> I feel like that whole dungeon plus boss was like four minutes, maybe five. Of course, I guess I didn't really do the whole dungeon. You know, technically. Only one monster is left. The Benevidon of Darkness. Oh. This is it. But we don't know where the Darkstone is. So both the stars were areas that were reasonably close to this dungeon, and I could have landed at either. And I didn't have a choice to do Darkness earlier than this. Understood. Uh, not good. 
but Nevadon will get more powerful if we don't find it. Soon. I need new equipment. Too worn out. It won't stand a chance. Oh, we got new equipment. Like, half an hour ago. <laughs> oh, wait! Josephine mentioned a city that had good equipment. Wait, Peta or whatever. We can go there to regroup. I don't have money. <laughs> anyway, I guess we're heading to Pe Peta. <coughs> It's almost like if you're constantly playing catch up on equipment, you're not building up the money they expect you to build up. I guess I'm gonna be skipping a tier of headgear, most likely. That'll help. Ancient capital Peta is west of Buka Island. I know we can get Swanga if we go to Peta. Jungle of Visions. Yeah, for some reason I was just thinking we took another boat ride and just found the Benevadon of Darkness. <laughs> That's clearly not what happens. It doesn't look like much of a around here. Really? It should be here. Huh. Maybe we should rest somewhere before we search. I mean, resting in strange places sounds like a good way to get attacked by zombies or something. But sure, yeah. Oh, do you actually interact with this? Welcome. Today is Mana Day. You can stay here free of charge. Would you like to rest? Yeah, there's absolutely nothing suspicious here. Uh, you didn't give me a choice about time of day. I guess we're just dozing until dawn. It's almost like this is a plot-related <laughs> slumber instead of an actual in interaction. Oh, now it has rest until evening, rest until morning. Again. Ancient capital Peta. Weird to put ancient in the name of your city. <laughs> Outside is different. What happened? This city is as strange as I heard. Right, I'll talk I to some. I bet we can find a lead on the Benevadon of Darkness here. I'll talk to some people, mostly the ones with stars, and then uh, save and quit. There's a Monastone Scholar here, you know. Have you seen him yet? No, I haven't. Uh, how do I get up on the? There it is. Dark Castle? Can't say I've heard of it. I have heard of a place called Light Castle, though. I think it's on a big island in the north of Laurent. You know it from that old prophecy of the prince who destroys his country. Why did I bring it up? Well, let's just say no one lives on that island anymore. That, that doesn't explain why you brought it up. I saw a fairy with Prince Richard. Can't remember the actual name of the hero king in this game. Uh, oh, are they actually down there? Oh, it must be in the building. Wait, 
Wait one second. How did this town get here? Everyone seems so busy all of a sudden. I didn't notice Reese anywhere. I can find her later. This stone tablet contains the goddess's prophecy about the world's end. You can't read it. Fine. I will interpret the text for you. The world will fall to ruin. The tree will wither. The sword will be corrupted, and despair will reign in the masked man's domain. But, three heroes. The rest of the stone was broken off. I'm sure it further describes the world's destruction at the hand of a masked villain. Probably. But we needn't worry yet. Besides, it has nothing to do with me. Yeah, it doesn't. Go talk to the Monostone Scholar. Oh, is that Reese? I was looking for someone in green. Do you have any idea what may have happened here? The ruins are now a perfectly functioning town. I think we traveled through time. But anyway, let's save Welcome. and quit for now. Next part, we can finish investigating about the Benevodon of Darkness and then finish the Benevodon's arc. See ya!